Yeah, the drums they swing low, and the trumpets they go. Hi, my name is Brandon Wadi, and welcome to the show. Today on the show, I'll be reviewing the video game Battlefield Hardline made by Visceral Dice and EA. Electronic Arts Incorporated, also known as EA Games, is an American developer, marketer, publisher, and distributor of video games headquartered in Redwood City, California, located in the United States. They partnered up with Visceral Games, who is an American video game development studio internally owned by Electronic Arts. They are perhaps best known for the critically acclaimed Dead Space series and their newest release of Battlefield Hardline. Battlefield Hardline is a first-person shooter video game developed by Visceral Games in collaboration with EA, Digital Illusion CE, and published by Electronic Arts. The game was released on March 17, 2015, and was released for the PS4, the PS3, the Xbox 360, the Xbox One, PC, and Microsoft Windows. Battlefield Hardline is a cops versus robbers themed shooter where you can either play with the law or fight against it. In this game you have the multiplayer where you can play against fellow players on dedicated servers in several different game types, but you also have the campaign where they put you in a drug controlled Miami and you play as Nicholas Mendoza, a detective in the Miami Police Department, and you have to get to the bottom of the several different drug busts throughout Miami. Let's take a look at some multiplayer gameplay. Here you see me going into my battle packs. I have three battle packs left open, so I open the first one. I get a very cool knife there, distinguish items, send that to my inventory. Next, I open another battle pack. Ooh, I get a golf club, which is very nice. Very good, thing, cool, very good and cool thing to own. Last, I get a voucher to unlock a free Team Pride skin for my character. So that's also very neat. In this clip, you see that we're just waiting in the spawn screen. And here we go, the counter the counter is finally counting down. Zero, and we're about to spawn in. Here were the criminals on this heist mission. We see the trucks with the money, so we shoot rockets at them. There you see one of them actually flies off of the bridge, but the other one is right there in front of me. So I go to set up the break-in, because obviously the money's on the inside. And after all, we're the criminals, so that's what we're in for. We're in for the money. In this next clip, you see the crane that's coming down that hit the side of the building. And you see it just tore off the entire side of the building. Here there's another guy in front of me, so I shoot him. And then unfortunately, I get shot in the back. Here it's just an enemy perspective of uh, who killed me, how, what he killed me with, where he shot me. So, you know, that's always nice. And here you see me on the radar waiting, for, waiting to be able to spawn in. And in this final clip, you see I spawn in on my teammate there. Uh, we have our teammate that has the package on the left side of me. And we see two people on the balcony, so I put some shots down, get a few hit markers. Unfortunately, I got a squad assist that also counts as my kill. And we were able to retrieve the money bag, so we celebrate with the victory. This game is very action-packed and exciting to play with a squad of friends or by yourself. It is very addicting with the multiplayer rank progression system and with the stunning single-player experience. I highly recommend this game. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Brandon Wadi, and I'll see you next time. And the trumpets, there you go. Yeah, the